Hello officers, welcome back to our new video. Today I will talk about NCD population. As we all know about NCD, but this is the important part of our health and wellness center. So I just trying to brushing up. So let's get start the video. Number first, when we think about NCD, what will be the question? The what will be the first question? arise in our mind the first question arise in my mind how to calculate ncd targeted population and how to calculate ncd monthly population i have posted a video about it if you have not watched that till now then go and check it out i will give the link in the description below so let's see it an easy way with an example suppose i have 1500 population in a total population in my health and wellness center area then i will be calculating with 1500 into 37 divided by 100 is equal to my ncd population that uh, that is uh, i think 555 and after that monthly target how to calculate for the monthly target we have to uh, divided by 12 is equal to my monthly target of health and wellness center and city population here one more question is arise for one person how many civic we have to fill up for one person for in the one year week form if um, that person is diagnosed positive then no need to fill up civic form next year for that person for the positive person one only civic form for their whole life but if not positive then continuously one in one year one civic will fill up by the asa what's the next when we should conduct ncd screening camp or ncd screening at our age in assam we used to do twice a week that is tuesday and friday uh, and uh, you can also conduct ncd so in health day which is celebrate in our health and wellness center or in the health and wellness center area in like uh, world cancer day world diabetes day world hypertension day in that occasion also we can conduct ncd screening or ncd screening camp in our hwc area so that we can fulfill our monthly target or at the end of the year we can fulfill our ncd target to whom we should do screening answer is to all people who live in our hwc area who cross their 30 years of age uh, let's see the process of screening firstly asa will fill up the CBEC form and they will uh, they will give score according to the CBEC form after that who got four or more than that give first priority for them and they will motivate them and uh, bring to the SWC or screening uh, area to screen the NCD, screen for NCD uh, important point is and during the CBEC fill up, if any woman uh, have an abnormality related to a uh, gynae problem like cervical cancer symptoms and menstrual problems, then ASA Baido will directly refer them to the district hospital or block uh, primary health center for further treatment if there is availability of gynae doctor. Part here, I have one tip for you. You can ask your ANM, MPW, and ASA to measure height, weight, blood pressure, and random blood sugar who have come for screening. So that you can smoothly running the screening beneficiary also get uh, quality Your care rule, uh, in the screening process is ask about family history uh, personal history and uh, do cross check the CBA form who have by the asha baido don't forget in between the meeting you can give awareness of cancer awareness of tb and awareness of ncd related things and for omen based self-examination you have to teach you can also ask your nm or mpw to teach or to give a health talk about awareness in between the screening after screening the question come into my mind is how um, who need referral and how to give referral what will be the procedure for positive patient who have got hypertension or diabetes or symptoms for oral cancer or symptoms for breast cancer what will be the procedure and then refer the patient after the telemedicine consultation and give the medicine as per the telemedicine consultation I already made a video about it. Go and check it out. I'll give the Last link in the description. Don't forget to ask the patient or don't forget to tell the patient to come with the prescription for follow up. Or last part is the incentive part. In this part, a question arises like uh, who, how to get TBI. Full job will get per one CBEC 10 rupees if they uh, fill up the CBEC and along with they have to motivate that person to come for screening if the screening done then they will get 10 rupees per asabido will get 50 rupees if the positive patient like hypertensive or uh, diabetes patient is come for follow up uh, monthly in a SWC for 6 months continuously we have to do portal entry in Saisha Sheva Dapun every month in that uh, Saisha Sheva Dapun last column is screening part or OPD part in the screening part you have to enter some um, some number of our ANM and MPW if they are cooperating with you in the screening process of NCD so that they will eligible for TBI they 
do subscribe my channel for more interesting video like this and hit the bell icon for your friends so that he or she can do ncd screening in proper bye, bye. see you in the next